Hey guys, welcome back again to another Tech Guru video. Today I will be showing you how to insert social media icons and links within your email signature. In today's internet environment, the social media platforms are the main way we connect with each other. Whether it be on Facebook, Google+, Twitter, or a video on YouTube, it is always a great advantage to have these links directly in your email signature. I will show you how to easily do this in today's video. So, the first things that we want to do is go ahead and access our email settings page. I am using Gmail. It really does not matter what email provider you are using. They all generally work the same way. So locate your home settings page here within Gmail. To do that, you will click on the gear icon and scroll down till you see settings click on the settings option. Once you are there, you then want to scroll down until you see signature. Now once you are within your signature editor, what you want to do is locate these images that you want to link to your social media pages. So there are certain ways you have to go about doing this. If we insert an image into our signature, the email providers do not allow you to upload an image directly from your computer. You have to add an image URL, and I'm about to show you how to go about doing that. Now, there are two ways that I suggest doing this. If you have a blog or a website, such as I do, at premiumtechtips.com, and you already have a nice icon set with your Facebook, Google+, and social profiles on it, use those images to insert within your signature. If you do not have a web page, you can go to Google and go to Google Images and search for social media icons, and you can find a ton of them there. Now, once you have your image located, you need to do this. You need to right click on the image and you need to go to copy image URL. You do not want to save the image as because this will save it on your computer's desktop. So copy image URL. Once you've copied that image URL, you then want to go back to your signature editor and click on insert or add image. Now it will ask you to provide the URL for this image. So right click in the box or command or control V and paste that URL. If you have done this correctly, you should see the exact image you are looking for. If you see no image, go back and try it again because you have done something wrong. Click the OK button and you now have this nice image within your signature. Now you are not done because you need to now link this image to the designated URL for that social platform. So if you click on that image there, you can adjust the size to be small, medium, or large. So if I click on small, it distorts it a little bit. So I want to revert it back to its original size. In order to add a URL to this image, I want to click and hold and select the specific image. I then want to get the URL for this image. So in this case, it is my YouTube channel. So I will click and go to my YouTube channel copy the entire URL, right click and copy or command control C, go back to my settings, click on the insert link or hyperlink option, and then it will say to what URL should this link go. I will then paste that exact URL within this box and I can now test this link or URL. Always test your links to make sure you have no dead links within your email signature. Now, once all of this is done, I will click OK. Now I have an image that has a link to where I want it to go. Once you have everything exactly like you want it, scroll all the way down and click on Save Changes. Now go to Compose a New Email, and if you look, your signature now has all of your social profile pages with links to each one. Now this is a great, great asset to have, especially when trying to connect with whether it be clients or just friends and family. So guys, if you have any questions, put them in the comment box below. Please don't forget to rate, like, comment, and subscribe. It does help me out, and I will see you guys next time.